Filipina. I'm a Filipina corporate lawyer. Look, I didn't really plan to do this. It's just that I saw my camera lying around. It just occurred to me that I've spent so many years following vlogs of people. I love watching vlogs. It's like my guilty pleasure, you know, my own version of reality TV, sometimes trashy reality TV. So I decided to make a vlog of my own. Uh, this will be based on my life as a corporate lawyer in the Philippines. So I hope you keep watching. If you like what you see, then please subscribe. Yeah, is that how this goes? I hope that wasn't too, too weird. Just, just a little weird. Just, just weird enough, you know. <laughs> so, that's my office. This is it. Where the magic happens. Swing. Okay, that's weird. Have you ever had those days where you just work so slowly? No matter how hard you try, I'm having one of those days. And the difficult thing about those kind of days is that it's not a rut that you can pull yourself out of, you know? You have to wait for the workflow to come back naturally. So, I'm still gonna try though. I mean, I don't really have an option. I have so much to do. Can you see? But, yeah, I just wanted to say that I'm having a like mentally slow day. It happens. Contrary to popular belief. See you later! Okay, so the reason why I speak so softly is that there are actually people who are working right outside my door. As in there are staff like right outside my door. So I don't want them to think that I'm crazy talking to myself. You know what I mean? Yeah. They probably do think I'm crazy though. That's alright. So. I'm just gonna work a bit more before I head out to my seminar. So this is what a lot of the people who want to go into lawyering because of how glamorous it is don't usually think about or they don't usually expect. It's it's just it's a lot of hard work staying in your office, paperwork, you know, the, all the non-glamorous stuff. That The less ugly you should look. Remember that, ladies. Hey guys. So my lips are looking kind of oily. Yep. Because <laughs> I'm having my lunch. Usually I have my lunch in my office. I'm not sure if I've mentioned this before, but usually I just eat at my desk because it saves time. Like, you know, I can spend the lunch hour, you know, at my desk getting a little bit more work in or relaxing a bit and watching some YouTube videos, which I love to do. I've recently learned how to cook. Like, I've been cooking for around two weeks now. I mean, what a late bloomer, right? But better late than ever. What I've been preparing lately consists of fish and vegetables. It's just a one-pan thing, really easy. Just saw some basic recipes online and just, you know, just totally, totally improvised. So this is what I usually prepare. Well, the food that I've been preparing for the last week anyway. Let me show you. It doesn't look the best, like, it's not the most appetizing looking thing in the world, but it's it's good. It's actually really good and really healthy. Can you see it? Not bad. Not bad at all. <laughs> I'm here, just puttering around my office, trying to get all my affairs in order before I leave for a seminar later today. It's a seminar at, um, I think it's at Dusit, yeah, that's right, Dusit Tani Hotel. Hey guys, I know I said that I was going to attend a conference today, but work got in the way, as per usual. I mean, it actually happens a lot. I actually wanted to go to that conference because my old law firm was one of the sponsors for it, but I mean, I'm not there anymore and I have more pressing work to attend to. I'm sure you lawyers can relate. Sayang, but you gotta do what you gotta do. I mean, I can't neglect my work to go to a conference. So, see you guys later. It's only like almost 2 o'clock now and I'm gonna run to a meeting. It's so funny because the counterparty to the meeting, their lawyers are 
the law firm that my dad used to be a part of. Now he's retired, but it's just, it's so funny. Such a small world. Life is funny, you know, and sometimes life plays out very, very well. I'm actually kind of excited to go to the meeting because I don't know if who's the papadala na lawyer there. I might actually know him or her. So, can't bring you guys to the meeting, but I will update you later. Bye! Ay, nga pala! I, I'm not wearing this to the meeting, ha? I'm just wearing a, this tank top today. Inside my room, you can see the door is closed. Because, mainit today sa room ko. It's either my room is like arctic cold or just melting point hot. <laughs> so, well, just have to adjust, diba? See you guys later! Hey guys! So, just came from the meeting and the blazer is off. Kita nyo naman. And it was really nice because, as expected, kilala ko yung lawyer ng counterparty na pumunta because nga, it was the law firm that my dad was once a part of. So, really, really nice. It was a very pleasant meeting and I think it went very well. It was such a good break to the monotony of, you know, daily work. Yung little pockets of surprises like that. These are like the little things that a lawyer looks forward to in the workplace. <laughs> so, check in with you guys later. Bye! Guys, random thought. When I'm super haggard, then I wear glasses. <laughs> my glasses! Because I can't be bothered to put on my contact lens solution. Because that takes time to wear. That's like 20 seconds spent putting liquid in your eye when you can just wear glasses. <laughs> yes, gonna look a hugger today. Uh, on the way to Greenbelt with the snack. The snack right here. <laughs> what was that now? Please? Your workout gun? What? Ooh, hey cutie. What? <laughs> hey cutie, do you have fungus from the floor? <laughs> from doing your workouts on the floor? With no mat. A man and his beer. What? A man and his beer. Your what? A man and his beer. Man and his beer. D and D. Man is out of beer. <laughs> man, man needs to get beer. <laughs> Caveman needs more beer. Yeah. <laughs> man Go get beer. it. Go get the magic juice. Love you. Stop it. Love you. No, no, no. He loves bugging his dad. No. Loves it. Like, lives for it. He especially loves jumping up on the couch, even if he knows that Mike hates it. And he's a smart dog, like, he knows. He gets it. But he'll try it anyway. Yeah, ah. there you go. Exactly. <laughs> oh. oh my gosh. Out. <laughs> Out. He's just doing it because he loves you. I know. I love him too, but out. Out. I love him too, but out. Out! Okay, guys. I have to mediate this dispute. Out! <laughs> Where's the pancho? <laughs> There's the pancho! Yes? Can I help you this humid November evening? May hey. I help you? Ah!
Sawa's dinner is Wagyu cubes with corned beef and egg. Looks so good, right, Pancha? Looks so good, huh? Yep. And then for me, we have fresh lettuce that I'm gonna eat without dressing. And then chicken breast with mushrooms, red crumbs, and parmesan. And Olive oil, lemon juice, rosemary thyme. So I'm gonna bake it in this Pyrex. It's gonna be so good for lunch tomorrow. Yes. 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 <laughs> so guys, washing my face at night. While watching my favorite lawyer. Sorry, my favorite lawyer on YouTube, si Isai Rivera. And guess who's with me in the bathroom? Guess who's always with me anywhere? <laughs> Super, he follows me around. Honestly. I don't know, I think he gets a kick out of watching whatever everyone else is doing. Like sometimes when he follows me around nga, sabi ng Josawa ko, Wow, Punch is so sweet. Like he's he's so clingy. But then I tell him, no, he's not clingy. He's just chismoso. Chismoso. <laughs> he wants to know what everybody is up to. He wants to get up in everyone's business. 